I'm going to create an animation of a man drinking from a glass of water. So file and new. I want 30 frames per second. And 5, 15, 400 is absolutely fine. Click OK. Now my first layer is going to be the man's head. So I don't think we need a capital D on. And file and import to the stage the image I'm after, which is drinking head. Now he's a little bit off, so if I can change that to here, which is the free transform tool, I think I want him just a little bit. So it's just this head is sort of quite level. And I want a second layer, which is going to be the glass. So file and import to stage. I've got a drinking hand there, but the glass is what I'm after. And again, obviously at the beginning of the animate, it looks like he's throwing water in his own face at the moment. The glass should be level, and I'm going to put it just out of view at the bottom of the animation. Okay? So now I'm ready to start animating. The only thing that's going to move it in this first scene is the glass. So I click on that, modify, and convert it to a symbol. So I'm going to call glass. And then I want to create a motion tween. So it's one second. Now I want both things to be in it. So if I select both of them, insert frame, I can now move the glass. So I just want to move the glass to where I want it to be, which is just by his mouth. So he's ready to start drinking. Then he's going to start tipping his head in the next scene. Now, at the moment, if I press play, what would really happen is when you bring something to your mouth, it would come quickly and then slow down. So I'm going to zoom in. And what I can do is I can grab hold of this line. I'll go back to the Select tool, bring it close, and I can drag this line forward and put a little bit of a curve on it. Okay. So what that's going to do, because the dots are closer together here, the movement is going to be slower here. So if I zoom back out and press play, and that little bit of a curve just makes it sort of drop into his mouth a little bit. Okay, so now I'm ready to do the next scene.